Well, hello everyone, what is going on? It is the Almighty Jeff, I'm here episode 33 of Saints Row 2. In the previous episode, we completed the mission, The Siege, I think is what it's called. The one where you fight Mero on the rooftop. It is indeed. We did the Saints Row Hitman activity, we picked up the pirate ship secret area, and we also bought the store in Stoughton. So we didn't actually manage to do that much in the last episode, but obviously we're going to hopefully finish off the Brotherhood in this episode. That may or may not happen, depends how long it's going to take me to do everything else, so I guess we better get started. Right, so we are in Adap Way in the southwestern corner. We are just in front of this little fountain area. What we need to do is drive forward, and you can see this grassy knoll over here. This is the first stunt jump for this next set. Pretty obvious. Don't flip. Come on, you are so close. No. It's tough. That's a great start to the sun jumps, isn't it? Don't blow up. Thank you. Alright, let's get another one. Bring me my Phoenix. Bring me my boss car. Hurry up. Be speedy about it, fool. Get out. Thank you. Alright, so the next one is number 58 for us, 59 for the guide. Uh, three bridges coming into Adap Way from the south. Yes, yes, and yes. If you take a look at the central bridge, not a uh, head north. Hang on, if you take a look at the central bridge, not a road that heads almost straight north from the bridge. Ah, right, okay. Um, so, I need to go back this way. And then this away. If we keep going straight onward. Without the taxis all colliding in the middle of the road. Hey! You're not know, meant to be driving when I'm trying to do a stun jump. That's just the rules. Okay, okay, no one crash into me. So well that you how did you hit that so badly? Come on. We're in a rush. I can't afford for you to be. I don't understand why it's do. Why it keeps. So it drives up slowly like that. Maybe we've just got to hit it slowly. I don't know. But it just climbed straight head on. Well, there we go. Number fifty-eight. Okay. So, we need to go to the friendly fire, which is obviously going to be a bit of a drive now that we're in the middle of nowhere, well, the middle of the freeway, but obviously the Phoenix wasn't having the big run-up that would have taken us straight over the motorway, of course, because the game hates me like that, like all my games do. Oh, oh, come on. Let's -a go, let's go. <laughs> Just popping tires. That's fun, that's why you should always get kneecappers. Like, I mean, it can be kind of annoying, but I find it a load of fun. Just just getting up close and be like... <laughs> collide straight into them, but you know, if we would have got a near miss... I'd take the tires out. Obviously the door's in the way, so it's going to make sure that I don't do that. I am doing terribly. We are not doing great, my dudes. I say we, it's just me, really. It's all my days. <laughs> that was literally, like, not even on purpose. Well, right, we're nearly there. Okay, so. I believe if we head down here. Down this little ramp. Oh, wait, hang on. Um, so anyway, then cross the street to the west, is she funny? Oh, wait, um... I'm gonna mix up with another one. Don't get in my face, please. Right, we need to come in here. Right, okay. I got it. Alright. There we go, number 59. And we're back on the freeway, look at that. 
Although I think it's a little. No, never mind. I was gonna be like, oh my days, people. I was gonna be like, I think it's gonna be easy to jump off it, but obviously not. Oh, 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 oh no! Come on, come on, come on, buddy! Come on, come on! Oh, oh, oh dear! We're pretty smoking. And I don't really want to go all the way down to Saints Row to get our car back. Or to get back onto the normal road. We most likely would have exploded our vehicle by then. But, you know, this is a shortcut back down. Alright, so let's call one more. We've only got one more stunt jump to do. And... Phoenix. Oh right, now there's two more stun jumps. Never mind, I got it wrong. All right, so we're going to the other friendly fire. Nope. Amber, that's brass knuckles. off. Oh, you know, run. You're you're being silly. You're having me on there, aren't you, buddy? All right, so we need to go down here. Yes, I remember this one. Cross straight through the gates, and boom, there we go, number sixty. Now if we I was gonna say if we if we go long enough, we might end up in Steelport, but that did not work. Okay, doc. Right. So, yep, that's another vehicle that we've lost. Never uh, mind. We've only got one more to do now. But that's for definite this time. Um, let's see, no good vehicles driving past. It doesn't appear. So we can't just do this the easy way. So I am just going to call up one more vehicle. No, oh, for goodness sake. Alright, now, will you? Recognize that I'm on land? I don't think it's gonna. Yeah. Phoenix is still in the water, technically, so. Let's just get a Temptress. Okay, slow down. Hey, 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 hey! Get back here. Fool. Alright. Uh, fill more, fill more, fill more. Um. Right, okay, so we need to go to Brass Knuckles. Which is where our next jump will be. Final jump of this set. And then we're going to move on to an activity, the six level variety. We did one in the last episode, I think. No, no, we didn't. It was. I just said it was kind of a while ago, wasn't it? Was it. No, because I remember, I remember the last one that we did was Crowd Control. That might have been a week before last. Whoa. Chill your beef, homie. Cameo to tease. There we go. Round the bend. Oh, come on. Stop crushing into every single thing you find, man. It's not great. I think we're too far away. No, no, we are not. All right, let's have a look. Um, film Mars of the weapon shop. Where well, you get there? Across the street, find a parking garage. Right. Okay. So you got a parking garage. Ah. There you are. All right. We should know what we're expected to do with these ones. Because they all the goddamn same. You go to the top. And then you jump off. Nice, nice work there, boss. Just drive right on into the ramp. You can't do anything right today, can you? Right, uh, there it is. Let's -a go. There we go, number 61. Oops, sorry. Okay, that is everything. We are all caught up. We are now going to do the Hotels and Marina drug trafficking all the way up here. Say all the way, it's not even that far, to be fair. And this will reward us with a reduction in Ronin notoriety, which will be relatively useful because, I mean, obviously, we've only got one more Brotherhood mission to do, and the only gang that we actually have to face left is the Ronin. Uh, we've got another DLC pack and Altar storyline to do as well, but it's nothing too bad. Oh, 
let's do this. Oh, we're driving pretty flawlessly. I must say, it's pretty fine and dandy. Oh, 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 beautiful. It was going good then, man. It was going good. Alright, you're not charging me money. Alright, let's fire up this baby. Luz? What you doing here? I thought the Colombians were sending their mule. They did. You're shitting me. Hmm. Why are you surprised? I just never thought I'd see you doing, like, actual work. Believe me. I wouldn't be here if Manuel hadn't cut me off. Yeah, that was a fucking shocker. Can we not talk about it? He found someone younger, didn't he? Are you gonna help me sell this shit or not? Well, aren't you the big bad drug dealer? You know what? Fuck you. I'm coming, I'm coming. I wouldn't want to miss this. Okay, okay. Level one. We're in a magma. Please don't let me die, okay? Do you think they're okay? They've got, they've still got an our, our Annihilator, so that's fun. Um, so, if you don't know, if you didn't play Central 1, this is Luth, who was sort of a member of the Los Canales. Oh, sorry. Of Los Canales, or the Canales. Don't want to piss off Dex. Um, but, yeah, well, she wasn't really a member, she was just the girlfriend of the boss, but. Obviously, she's the one, she's one of the people who we actually spared. So. So she got sort of a happy ending, I mean, compared to everyone else who died, but. <laughs> yeah. So we've only got two levels of Ronin. Hey! Ah, fool. Wow, you've really just trashed this car. Oh, it's probably me. I don't even know. I don't care either. Ooh. I do, Luth. How far away from this guy? Come on. You need to drive straight, Luth. Come on, dude. I'll do that. Right. Shut up. I said shut up. Are you shut up too? You? You get involved? Boom. You guys with two gangsters here for me. For me. Hold me. I was going to say fool and homie. I have a way with just accidentally mixing up two words all the time. It's not good. We seem to be driving the long way around. Luth, you could have literally just drove straight up and ran like that, but of course. This is why it's better when you do it in co-op, where you actually have you, yourself or the co-op partner driving. Because you can actually drive. Listen, buddy old pal. Sit the frick down. Luth is pretty badass as a driver, to be honest. Whoa, frame rate. Are you shooting now? Listen, fool. If I wanted you involved, I would have asked for you. I would have called 911, but I don't need 911. Get out of the way, fool. I think we're nearly there. This is how long it's going to take to do level 1. Jeez Louise. It's like three minutes. Okay, okay. There we go. Level one. Hundred dollar reduce. <laughs> Minus respect. Fair enough. I think it forgot which way I was meant to go then. But anyway, I shall see you guys at level six. All right, guys. Here we are. Level six. Let's see, we're in um, a Ronin vehicle. Had to do a quick swap out in level five. Um, from bloody five stars not right at all, which is not great to be fair. It means we have to worry about limiting our shots, which I did last time. I was like, I don't think we should carry on shooting them because we were very close to level five. So we use everything that we can to keep them off us. I think this one's actually a lot easier than the one with. Toby's cousin. Uh, I don't know what it is. I think Luth, Luth, Luth is a better driver, I should say. 
than Toby's cousin and doesn't usually take forever. My new <laughs> proved me wrong just as I'm about to say that you know lose you had potential. Come on. It's the police as well really. Those are the ones with a heavier firepower. Because they can bring in helis and shit. We have limited rocket slot. No, uh, limited rockets now, so we want to be careful. Just want to be. It's usually a lot better if you just shoot out the driver rather than, or even just shoot, if you shoot out all the residents of the car. It's still better off than blowing it up because that seems to add on a lot more notoriety than just killing them all. Well. Obviously with the Ronin, doesn't really matter. We're on maximum notoriety anyway, and there's no losing that. It's a fixed notoriety one. Uh, we'll get into the Nordberg. Right, come on, Luth. Let's go. Alright, our rockets. Um... Gotta... Uh oh, uh oh, move, move. Go on, Luth, get it done, get it done, meet with your client. Run, fool. I'm surprised that the the clients are not just running their way, because I mean, we've got like the gangs and the police obviously knowing about the deal, so I'd be like, yeah, nah. But, whatever. This is still water, and I assume it's just kind of a normal thing. Let's take this one. Oh, come on. <laughs> These fools. Look at them. We're doing pretty quickly with this, though. Oh, yeah, I don't have any. Fuck, it's just forgot then, somehow. Alright, Luth. Quick. Very open spaces, by the way. Nothing really discreet about the way that they're doing this. Just want to be careful that, you know, they don't get all aggro. Alright, Luth, come on. Just switching cars every time. I mean, it's a useful tactic, to be honest. Alright. Not much more left to do. Oh, bloody Nora. Miles off to the next one. Oh. Boom. There you go. <laughs> These fools. Let's give us some room, give us some room. There you go. Oh, we've pretty much got there. Well done, Luth. I need the cars a lot more flexible than the like the massive what was it hippie van that was like obviously a quite a heavy vehicle so it would have been a lot harder to move about in okay we're done how far got to try oh, not that far should be easy peasy Doing level six for the first time, eh? Pretty, pretty impressive, I should say. How we looking time-wise? About thirty-four minutes, so I've uh, still got time to cut out. I think what I may do is I may save the Brotherhood finale until the beginning of next episode. All right, can we make it? Can we make it without it blowing up? I think we can. Come on, you're so close, you're so close, you're so close. There we go, Luth. What a good girl. Good girl indeed. Alright, that's level 6 complete. And 5k in our bank. We are not to run in notoriety reduced by, I think it's 15%. If I remember correctly. Which is going to be useful because those guys are annoying as hell, obviously, as you just witnessed. Okay, so. 
that is that. Now we are going to move on and pick up the downtown loft, which is one of the two remaining cribs in the game. The last upgradable one. The last one is a dock. The suburbs dock, I think. So we'll get that eventually as well, but at least then we'll know that if we ever need to pick up our cash and stuff, we've got places all over. Let's just bail out of there. Doesn't really matter because we're right at where we need to be. <laughs> all right. So we spend 50k on that. Shouldn't really be much of an issue to us right now. We still have 478k left, so we can buy a lot of those. Okay, um, let's upgrade everything. I want to go ultra modern, as per usual. Alright, <laughs> due to unforeseen circumstances, I'm going to have to speed this up a little bit. I'm going to have to finish it here, so it might be a bit of a short episode. I do apologise. Um, so, we've done that. Let us just pick up our cash, which is back here. Everything's all set. It is indeed. So let's just save our game once more. We have gone from what is it? Let's just have a quick look. 67 to 69 percent. Not too shabby. Um, so yeah, I'm sorry this is a bit short, uh, but I'll make up for it in the next episode where we will actually finish off the Brotherhood finally. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.